Live from Philadelphia, this is Fox 29 News at 10. Well, it wasn't exactly a get your motor running, head out on the highway kind of day, but more than 100 local bikers did just that and more to raise money and awareness for a worthy cause. The bikes were revved up. The riders were bundled up. Still, the race was on to help the Center for Autism. It was a bitterly cold ride from Ambler, PA, to the Citizens Bank Park in South Philly. We were able to raise over $8,500 today. But the awareness and money raised will go a long way helping people with autism and their families. Happy is not the word. This was great fun. Uh, we're so excited that the Lucky Seven joined us in this event. Uh, and we're looking towards bigger and better futures. The Lucky 7 Motorcycle Club hosted the event, but dozens of area biker clubs pitched in. Joe Angelicchio of North Wales wanted eight-year-old Casey along for the ride. And it's just becoming more and more of an issue, and a lot of it comes down to the care. A lot of people really don't know how to care for their own children that have the problem. And uh, that's what the center really does. It was way too cold for Casey and others to take the ride, but they were revved up for the rally with a little help from the very cozy Philly fanatic. <laughs> Special honoree Rick Shiraki holds up a huge trophy presented by the honorable biker judge Seamus McCaffrey, outspreading the word. We're starting to see the emblems on the back of folks' cars. We're starting to see people saying, like, what's that about? What exactly is autism, and how does it affect our families? And so far, today's event has raised about $10,000. They're still counting. The Center for Autism has been serving Pennsylvania, New Jersey, and Delaware since 1955. It is the oldest program of its kind in this country.